Um, thanks for taking the time to chat to us. I got to watch the movie yesterday. Um, wow. Yeah. Um, so super excited about that. Um, straight into it, I believe, um, I was just doing some research, that you got the call to be um, part of the movie while you were on Honeymoon. Yes, I was. How do you even remotely focus on your honeymoon when you get uh, get the casting call to be part of um, one of the most incredible movies? Um, I was just really surprised to be to be honest, and um, I mean it was kind of like the best gift, and we really celebrated uh, on our honeymoon. Um, and it was just me and my husband, and he's always been a huge support in my life and career. So it was really good to share that moment with him. Oh, that's super special. And um, look, I must say, you, you, your your uh, your role that you played was absolutely incredible. I I want to ask you. I think after watching the movie, the actual heroes are the ladies in the movie. Um, I don't know if you would agree, but if you have to think about all the roles that all the ladies played, they were actually you know instrumental in how the movie played out. Do you agree? Oh, absolutely. And I think the ladies all together we deserve like an in our own independent film in Marvel. Don't you agree? I absolutely do agree. That was actually a question that I want to wrap up with. And I know um, that you can't say too much if it is possible, but I, I mean, if there is going to be a sequel, which I think they said 10 Rings will return, we're hoping you'll be part of that show more in the future. I was just talking to the producer last night about it at yeah. dinner. <laughs> we're like brainstorming. We're like, hmm, can I? I wish I can. Because I, I mean, besides outside, you know, telling the story, I just feel like there's so much room for, you know, development um, for our world, for the audience to see more of that world because it's fascinating to me. And at the same time, selfishly, I just really love the cast. We became really close friends and almost like a family. So I would just hate to think this is the last time we'll, we'll be working together. So I'm sure we'll see each other again. Well, I certainly hope so as well. I certainly hope we can see more of your character and the, the Talao world. Uh, maybe mm -hmm. that's a completely separate movie. I think that'll be quite special to see as well. Um, one more question. I just want to see, you know, like how, do, as an actor, I always find this fascinating. How as an actor do you get into that role of being a mother? Do you relate that now? Because I know you've recently had a baby girl, which is incredible. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank do you. Relate you. The, are you able to relate those two together um, while you're shooting somehow? No, I mean, when I was, first time it was actually my first time playing a mother when I received the role so I had to do a lot of research to go you know to to understand it or to know how to play it but you know shortly after I got pregnant and I became a mother myself now I'm like oh you know that's that's how it feels I was you know <laughs> acting I was faking it but it also which is part of my job but now I really have a lot more feelings about motherhood I'm still learning you know every day she's growing and changing so mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, I think next time I play a mother, I think I can do a little bit better. Well, um, I don't think you should beat yourself up at all. I know you're not doing it, but I just <laughs> want to say you, you absolutely nailed the role. It's, uh, it's an honor to talk to you. Thank you so much. I'm looking forward to seeing you more uh, with the Marvel Studios. 947 Drive with Tandor. Monday to Friday, 3 to 7 p.m.